Welcome to another Tableau tutorial video. I'm Weston Palmer. Let's get started. Today I'm going to expand on the concept of sorting data using parameters. Now we've done this before on previous videos. I'm going to just create a parameter, sort criteria, and you can come in here and you just change this. We're going to change this to string. I'm going pretty fast on this. We want this to be a list. And we're going to say um, calls and just defaults, oops, and then time talked. This is for some call centers. And so we've got that information and we're going to create now a calculated field, sort field. And actually what I do in this situation, I like to I like to show the criteria or show the parameter because you know as you know Tableau is uh, case sensitive and I want to make sure I've got the exact spelling so if the sort criteria and what we want is we want the same value that's being used down here so we're saying call so we're going to put down some number of calls and I'm actually going to put it else if because I'm going to be adding some other criteria here in just a second and this one is average duration seconds All right and then hit end We've done this already, we've done this on previous videos, and then we're going to bring the sort field. It's going to come up as a continuous, so you just come in here, change this to discrete, that'll make it go blue, and we're going to move it to the front. And so now we're going to, um, you can see here's the number of people that have three, is the number of calls. And maybe if you want it to be in descending order, what you would do is this is often the case is you just come in here and you just put a negative in front all right and so now it's going to be number of calls in descending order or time talked here's the most time talked so let's say I want to now go back to um, I want to see the earliest start date so we're gonna come in here Edit the parameter. Let's say earliest start because maybe you want to see who's the earliest, you know, who's the person that's worked there the longest. So we come in here to field and we'll say this is a little bit of a trick question because you're going to come in here and you'll say, okay, we'll do sort criteria. I should have just copied that, huh? And the field is aggregate start date. So we'll just put uh, start date. And now you get an error. What is the error? You expected type float, <clears throat> found date. <clears throat> and so what it's saying is, well, you're running into problems because some of these are numbers or floats, and some of this is date. And so I can't do both of them. So how do we fix that? So let's, uh, what we're going to do is we're just going to say else, if it's not one of those, we're just going to make it null, okay? And then we'll come over here to sort date. We're going to duplicate it. Edit. We're going to change this up here to date. And if the criteria is instead of calls, earliest start, then we can put in the aggregate date or the start date. And then we can get rid of this other stuff. Now that works. So now we're going to bring the sort date up to the up to the rows line change that to discrete 
move that over and now when we select earliest date you'll see that this first one went all null so if it all went null then it's going to default to the next column it's going to sort by that and that we've already identified as the earliest uh, the start date right and so the other option the next one taking this to the next level is we're going to add a criteria because maybe we want to put it this is agent numbers but it may be a time where you want it to be um, alphabetical uh, I, do, I do deal a lot with suppliers and so we say hey I don't I don't know the number of this or the number of that but I do know the supplier name and so I want to find that and so now if you hit let's just take a look what, what's going to happen right on this one here if it's alphabetical this is going to go into null right this is going to go to null that's the date and then what's the, going to be the next column to sort on ISC the agent number so let's see if that works so these are going to be both be null and then you're going to filter by um, alphabetical so let's go ahead and hide these when you go into your dashboard you have this little drop down that allows you to sort by number of calls time talked early start date alphabetical and you can change these up and have as many other different data types but it's that concept you're going to have a uh, sort field for each of the different data types. We have one for numbers or floats, we have one for date, and then if nothing else it defaults to this first column which is um, alphabetical. Hope that helps. I know it helped me. Thanks for watching and a big shout out to our latest Patreon subscriber Don Border. Thanks for joining the family Don. Check out these other videos to learn even more about Tableau.